Welcome to the Micropulse ISIS Quick Start Video Tutorial. All content of this video is the opinion of Robert Dennis. This is not medical advice and you must seek advice from your doctor. For more ISIS tutorials, visit YouTube and search for ISIS PEMF. In this tutorial, we'll show you how to place the coils and we'll also tell you basically how to use the device. We recommend that you always use fresh rechargeable 9 volt batteries. Remove everything from your kit. First take out the pulse generator, then the chip tester, then remove the 9 volt battery that we send along. It's not rechargeable, but it'll get you started right away. Then take out the two coils. We send standard length, two foot long coils with every set. Finally, you may also have an optional self-adhering bandage in your package. Make sure you take all of these parts out and have a look at them. Unwrap one of the sets of coils. Make sure that you stretch the coils out a little bit and then gently plug the coils into the ISIS pulse generator. This will take a second, but once you've got them inserted, put them in all the way firmly. Set the intensity switch to the letter M. This is medium. I'll increase the contrast so you can see it clearly. And also make sure that the power switch is set to zero, which is off. Insert the battery with the larger terminal facing upward. That's the negative terminal and it looks like a crown. Place the battery in firmly till it clicks in place and always use a fully charged battery. Now switch the power on. You'll see a green LED on the ISIS pulse generator flashing. If you place the coil tester between the two coils, you'll also see green flashing LEDs. The rate of flashing will change every few minutes. This is normal. You can use self-adhering bandage or you can use sports tape to hold the two coils into configuration, such as side-by-side -side configuration as I'm showing you right now. We have a lot of other configurations for the coils that can be used, and to see these, you should look on YouTube and search for ISIS PEMF tutorial. Each set comes with two coils that are the standard length of two feet, but you can buy longer coils that are four feet long or shorter coils that are one foot long from our webpage. You can buy coils that are the right length for the treatment you want to make. Coils can be configured side by side or on opposite sides of an injury. We recommend you start with the side-by-side -side coil configuration. One of the most common uses for ISIS is to treat lower back pain. You can do that by placing the coils side-by-side -side over the painful site. Some people try to place the coils along the spine, but we find that that generally causes discomfort, so we recommend that you do not do it. We recommend that you place the coils side-by-side -side across the spine as shown. For deep organ treatment, Place the coils on opposite sides of the body. The upper spine and neck can be treated as shown. The shoulder and rotor cuff can also be treated as shown. Knees and elbows can be treated as shown. You should try both side by side and opposite side configurations to see what works best for you. Once you've placed the coils, hold them in place with bandages. ISIS is an ultra low power portable system. You can use it all day or all night or 24 hours. You'll just need to replace the batteries about once every day. For more detailed tutorials, please visit youtube.com and search for ISIS PEMF tutorials or watch videos on my channel, Robert G. Dennis. The preceding video is for informational purposes only. It is not intended as medical advice. For medical advice, you must seek the opinion of your physician.